Welcome to this DevOps Basics video about detecting memory leaks. Start web logic. Start JVisual VM from the JDK bin directory. Connect to the running WebLogic JVM. Select the profiler. Click on Settings. At the Memory Settings tab enable the recording of allocation stack traces. The application with a memory leak is already running. It's a timer EJV triggering two methods every one second. No leak is allocating and freeing a lot of memory, it has no leak. Slowly leaking vector has a memory leak because of a coding error the removal of one item is forgotten. Now the challenge is to detect the tiny leak but not the method that allocates and frees a lot of heap space. Click on memory profiling. Instrumentation is running now, this will take a couple of seconds. Profiler is redefining classes. This takes approximately two minutes. Here are the profiling results. Surviving generations are displayed. The higher the number, the more likely it is a memory leak. Keep the application running for a while. Now there is a big difference in the surviving generations metric. Create a snapshot. Right click on the class with highest number to see the allocation tree. All these objects are created because of the tiny leak. The other method using a lot of heap is not detected at all. CPU usage and heap are displayed in a graph as well. Also thread activity is shown. Thanks for watching. Let's stay in touch.